Hello and welcome to Amsterdam. We're in position here at the Johan Cruyff Arena. I'm Derek Ray on the commentary gantry and delighted to be joined as always by Stuart Robson and getting ready for what should be potentially thrilling action here. It's Ajax versus Manchester United. Well, Derek, when looking forward to this game, you can't help but notice there are some great matchups all over the pitch, particularly in those central areas. Whichever team wins more of those battles will win the game. Well, what a stop that was. And over comes the corner. That's how to blunt the edge of the opposing attack. Pogba. Will it be? Corner coming up. Playing it in, and the problem not completely solved. And given his magnificent form, then there's every reason to believe that Cristiano Ronaldo will make an impact here. Well, Derek, you know he's a good all-round finisher. Oh, they might score here, Stewart. And a really good diving stop. Over it comes. Smuggled away. Tadic. Deep delivery. Plattered away. And good pressure high up the pitch. And somehow kept out by De Gea. Let's see about the delivery. Relatively straightforward to mop up defensively. And continues his run. That's a nice looking ball. A very effective clearance. Jaden Sancho. Bruno Fernandes has it. And dispossessed. And the keeper reacting just as we would have expected. Superb defensive judgment to end the attack. Oh, breezing past him. Might take the lead. He's found the back of the net. Marcus Rashford. Well, here we can see it again. Look at the way he glides past the defender to create space for himself. And then the finish is fairly simple in the end. That's a good goal. to be and they need to get tighter the high press was on and that's a fantastic tackle brilliant save well a poor effort from a difficult angle Stuart well he took the wrong decision there he surely had to cut that back No degree of difficulty at all for the keeper. Oh, pressing really high. Not to be advised giving the ball away in that position. This could be the equaliser. And collected tidily. He had plenty to think about.
And there, can he get them level? That's great goalkeeping. Well, what a save that is. He was so alert there. Who's going to get on the end of it? No keeper will mind that sort of corner. Well, as you can see from those stats, their creativity has been really good. They've dominated play at times. They've got the ball into the final third with great ability. But when they've got it there, the finishing just hasn't been good enough. And that's been their problem. Now, counter-attacking possibilities here. Well, it fizzled out. Going about his defensive business with a minimum of fuss. Well, nicely cut out. Now, what can they do with the ball? Allaire. Fruitful-looking attack. An incisive pass. And a goal! Back underway, level pegging, one goal apiece in this game. And the timing was perfect, ball one. Ronaldo, real chance. Oh, a superb save. Well, they might be piling on the pressure, but they've got to make it count in those situations, that's for sure. Tadic, in with a chance. And not cleared away properly. Well, good defending, plattered out of there. Not giving him a moment's peace. Having won the ball back, they might be able to profit. Can he put them in front? And he didn't hesitate. Good thing, too. Well, he's so quick off his line. That's great goalkeeping, you have to say. Tadic. Oh, terrific save from the keeper. Well, that's just a wonderful save. How did he stop that? Over it comes. It's still alive. And it goes down as a missed opportunity from there. Jaden Sancho won it back. Oh, good looking run. Well, everyone makes mistakes, so it's about how you bounce back from them. But into the keeper's gloves. Well, in terms of added time, a minimum of one minute. Well, a poor attempt at a challenge, and on he goes. Magnificent defending. And with that, the first half draws to a close. Well, very hard to contain in the first 45. Sebastian Allaire, give us your assessment. Plenty to consider based on what we've seen so far as the second half begins.
It's a good looking ball in behind. Big opportunity. Well, he stumped it out of there without much fuss. Given away by Manchester United. Sebastian Allaire. Poor pass under no real pressure. Illegal play and hence a free kick. Well, he knows he's on his last warning after that one. Well, I don't think it warranted a yellow card. He made a genuine attempt to play the ball there. Well, not one, Stuart, that's going to live long in the memory. Well, I think the manager might disagree, Derek. Any way you cut it, it's a wasted opportunity. And he read it superbly. Allaire. in the center oh he looks threatening well in the final analysis it was good defending Fred Fred and a very good challenge Well, couldn't keep it. Well, he prevented it from going over the line. Given away by Manchester United. But attacking possibilities. They could nudge in front. And there is the goal! He's found the net. Joy unconfined. Well, as we see it again, he was never going to miss that, was he? That's a really simple finish in the end. So United restart the game. Disappointed to have conceded. Can they come up with an equaliser? Not up a cul-de-sac in terms of the attack. This might be ideal for the counter. Do they have the guile to open up the defence? Oh, moving it nicely. Allaire. Poor attempt at a pass, really. Opportunity. No hiding from the fact that they really... They should have extended their lead. Well, that was a poor miss. Could they come to regret that? And it might be. And there it is. The goal they wanted for security. They lead by two now. They can breathe that bit more easily. Underway again with the score at 3 1. Aller. Oh, now Aller. Well, if truth be told, he made it rather straightforward for the keeper. Well, he knows it. That is a real waste of a great opportunity. Could be. Well, the keeper is happy. The ball was there. And keeper's ball in the end. Well, look at the relief out there. That looked a certain goal, didn't it? Well, they won't come much closer than that. It's a matter of inches from being a really good goal. Blint lost the ball. And providing width. 
Oh, great attacking play. Textbook defending inside the box. Here's Berghaus. Mazraoui here. Must be! Superb stop! Cleared away. And a shot from some way out. Decent effort there. Well, he has such good technique. He really did hit that well. He certainly came close there. And United will switch things around personnel-wise. Well, as those stats tell us, their attacking play today has been exceptional. Defenders have come out at the right time. The midfielder completely dominated the game. And the front player's movement has been excellent. Crossing possibilities. Really vital interception here. Grafenberg. How can he take them on and beat them? Oh, just wide of the mark. Goal kick. Well, that never looked like troubling the keeper, did it? But it was worth an effort. A good strike from him. Here's a change for Manchester United. Ten minutes left for play. And space to attack. And the challenge halts them in their tracks. And the counter-attack is on. Options available. Can they keep it going? Oh, surely. It was an excellent example of how to break at pace. Well, that's counter-attacking football at its best. They switch on so quickly when they win the ball back. It deserved a goal. Given away by Ajax. And so into the final five minutes. Oh, he's through here. And they've reduced the arrears. You never know. They still believe in themselves. Well, here it is again. He goes past his marker so easily with just a drop of the shoulder. But in the end, it's far too easy to create the 2v1 against the keeper. What were the defenders trying to do? Nice finish, but poor defensively. 3-2 it is. Who would have predicted that before a ball was kicked? Flint. Tadic has it. They've won back possession. And the free kick awarded to Manchester United. Well, a judgment call for the referee. Many an official would have cautioned him. Can they fashion something? They need a goal. Rashford. Has a go. Oh, a goal! An equaliser in the closing stages. Well, here we can see it again. Look at the way he glides past the defender to create space for himself. And then the shot could not be hit any better. He's struck with such venom. Great goal. Not many sides would have the mental strength to bounce back from adversity like this team. And that is going to be all for this game. Well, we were treated to goals, but no winners in the end. Stuart, what did you make of it? Well, Derek, it was certainly entered.
All roads lead to Manchester today, and we're at the Etihad for a special derby. It is City versus United. Derek Ray here on the commentary position, and sitting alongside me to provide expert analysis is Stuart Robson. Can't wait for this one, Stuart. Well, what a great environment to play football. Let's just hope we see two sides who want to win the game, rather than being too defensive. This should be a very good game between two excellent teams. And here's the Manchester City lineup. Ederson gets the nod in goal. Kyle Walker plays with Joao Cancelo in the fullback positions. Bernardo Silva plays alongside Rodri in the centre of midfield. And the striker today is Raheem Sterling. And the advantage is with City. It's a fine United move in the making. He takes aim. And there's the delivery. Rashford. And he's kept it out, fully stretched, somehow reaching it. Playing it in. Sancho. Terrific block. Well, unable to bend his run offside. He's feeling the pressure here. Deflected behind, corner forthcoming. Can he convert? Good work to win it back high up the pitch. And the danger is averted. Jaden Sancho. Really good diving save. Who can he pick out? And taking it away. Ronaldo. And the goalkeeper has outdone himself with that save. Corner kick played in. It comes to nothing in the end. And Fred winkling possession away from the opposition. De Bruyne. Now can they counter clinically? Well, they seem to be onto something positive, but it faded away. Ronaldo. And let's give credit to the defending. Bruno Fernandes now shot happy here putting his body on the line well not quite what he wanted to do with the pass Bruno Fernandes oh the perfect ball now how about this it's still alive Mares and a goal Paul Pogba Cristiano Ronaldo well that's how to beat your opponent plays it back Rashford unable to hold it Stones Ake has it Kevin De Bruyne Silva. Bernardo Silva distributing intelligently. And it's gone in! The team's separated by two goals now. You cannot say they don't deserve it. Well, a second goal for them here. It's going to be United's free kick. Now Paul Pogba. A goal! That's exactly what they needed. That should get them believing again. So on with the match. 2-1 is the scoreline. What's going to happen next?
Kevin De Bruyne. And it's Gabriel Jesus. Superb block. So approaching half time with United behind, albeit narrowly. Stuart, what have you made of their performance in the first 45? Well, it's certainly been an open game with chances for both teams. But they must start winning some of those individual battles, particularly in the wide areas, if they're going to get anything out of this. They're getting right on top of their opponents and winning it back. No real conviction in the challenge. And the quality of pass needs to be a bit better. He's in with a chance. And Sterling has it. Gives it a go. And a wonderful diving save to deny the opportunity. That's a short corner. Joao Cancelo. On to Silva. And back with Bernardo Silva. Mares. De Bruyne. A very effective challenge put in. Cristiano Ronaldo. Fred. Bruno Fernandes. And he's made headway. Magnificent stuff. And quite the comeback from two goals down. So back underway. Dead level. 2-2. And Foxing the defender. Good defending in the end. And danger averted for now. A chance then for the respective managers to address their charges. It is half time here. Well, a more than satisfactory performance from Ronaldo in the first half, Stuart. Well, that's exactly what his team needed because they weren't at their best in the first half. And once again, it shows what a key player he is. Can they build on that in the second 45?